Hello everybody, it is ZB Taylor here and welcome back to Outlast. Um Where did we leave? We got thrown out of a window after we got called a little pig. Even though I could have sworn he said little fig. Little fig. Who knows? Um and then we saw a guy who claimed that I was an apostle from the merciful god. And then we got here. Oh, hello, I forgot the controls. Proclaim the gospel. What is that noise? This is extremely loud in my headphones. You look quite dead. Oh, you don't have a head. But you have a nice neck. Now, for the life of me, I can't... Batteries. For the life of me, I cannot remember which one drains more battery. Whether it's like this or like this. Oh, this makes everything look a lot better. Please say they are flies. <laughs> oh, computer screens. Have they got anything on them? Password. Can I type in a password? Damn it. <laughs> Good god, I can't see a thing. Oh, you're dead. Hey, bro. That's a tree, not a person. Uh, it's a computer. Oh god. Desk. Oh shit, you're dead. Oh, fucking hell. What's down there? Bookshelves. Oh! What's this? Oh, okay. No. Oh, is it this one? Yeah. I'm inside. I'm inside. Bodies everywhere. Blood. Burn masks. Bark marks. Burn marks? Heads lined up like bottles behind a bar. Dead Murkoff scientists hung upon the ceilings. Their badges say Murkoff Advanced Research Systems. Murkoff's long-time MO has been to has been to profit off the exploitation of supposed charity. Fuck the third world and bankroll another billion. How did Murkoff think they would make money off a building full of crazy people? They're some kind of tactical cop pinned like a pig on a spit. <laughs> I don't know. Tells me to get the fuck out and then dies. Would have been a good thing to hear when I could still leave the way I came. Wait, there was a dock in the middle of the dock. It's the. Oh no, this isn't Wall Rider. Age 32. What's his name? Oh, Walker. Therapy status. More. Morphogenic engine activity. Plitude, I don't know what that means. At a roughly 2000 ppm. Unsafe to progress beyond stage 3 hormone schedule. Diagnostics. Spiro spiro spirometry revealed light, light to medium bronchial accumulation. That's something in here, I swear. The bronch. I don't know. <laughs> MRI scans con consistent with patients reported to dreams. Interview notes. Walker has was interviewed in restraints following his self-inflicted mutilations. Restraints have been added to the restraints have had to be altered to accommodate his enormous size. Oh god. Oh, is that me either threw us over the balcony? Extensive dermal er eruptions on consistent as consistent with failed morphogenic engine cellular activity. He claims the skin ripped from his forehead allows it for a truer way of seeing, seems to have some boyhood experience with Tuatara lizards and their per paracial eyes. I don't know what that means. <laughs> he has expressed anxiety about his flesh, specifically around his lips and nose. Atten attending orderlies should be advised to watch for thir further self-mutilation. The mental traumas he sustained while serving in Afghanistan seem to be retarding progress of the ME process. 
His predominant fixation, of, amplified by therapy, is a manic I, exaggeration of military secu security protocol. A continuation of both chemical and physical restraints is highly needed. I can, oh, that's nice. Trails of my own blood. The fuck? What? Why well, do I need a peek? What's on here? What? Ah. Anything here? There's a trash can. Nope, nothing. Okay. Oh, hey. Fuck, you're alive. Okay. Anything on this side? No. Hey, bro. You look creepy as fuck. I'm just gonna walk past you. Don't look at me. Oh, you have no eyes, it's fine. Oh, notes. Okay. Broken men and dead. A crowd of broken men watching a dead channel. They look like patients. They survived whatever happened here, but nobody's home. Oh, I can hear matey. Oh, that's horrible. Bro, do you want to like shut up? I can hear you. Is that a bike? It's a bike. Oh, you look like you're going to eat my face off. You don't look like you have a face. Oh, so beautiful. Oh, there's a blood stain. Whoa, your face is ugly. Bro, your breathing sounds a lot like mine. I don't know where I'm going. Do you have a head? Oh, you do have a head. Oh, you're still alive. Uh, where do I go from here? For here? Of course I can't. Why, why, why would that be a thing? Why am I going? Shh! Just be quiet. I might wake up some undead people. Can I see your face again? No? Okay. Where do I go?
हर Run! Oh, what? Have I been poisoned or some shit? <sighs> Fucking knew that was gonna happen. Oh, good lord, you are quite severely barred up. Come alive. Oh, that's not a good sign. Oh, note that you can look behind. What? I have no idea what it, that just said. Why? 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 Why have you got a splash? Oh, I'm in the toilet. Okay, there's a janitorial cupboard. Janitorial? Is that a word? I'm like hunched up. Like, I'm about to hug myself. Witness. I'm just gonna chuck that. And this one. Okay, so fuck that. Ah, oh, go away. I'm already beat. I'm already beat all to hell. Picking broken glass out of my scalp. Couple of cracked, couple cracked ribs. Nearly killed by a deformed giant. Looks like somebody tried to fuck start his head with a cheese grater. Ugh. He throws me. He throws me through a wall. Knocks me unconscious. I wake up. And some dull, dewy old man, with a face like an alcoholic kitty fiddler, <laughs> in a homemade priest outfit, calls me uh, his apostle. Not, not a job I asked for. The. There are words scrawled in blood everywhere. I'm getting an ugly feeling the feeling in my gut that the priest is writing them for my benefit. Bro? No? Good. What's in this one then? Who's shagging? Oh, I have shadow. Hello. I'm just gonna shut. No, I can't shut the door. That's a hand. High five. That was kind of uncalled for. That's a fan. Right. That sign clearly says exit. So why the fuck am I still in here? Oh, dismembered body parts. That is a head. Why am I doing this? Oh, your head got. Oh, your head's still there. Nice. Is it worth finding up in this door? Nope. Why am I in here? This is just a room. I don't need to be in here, so let's not be in here. How's that for an idea? Anybody down there? Right, so there's an exit there, but there's an exit behind me. How does that work? Oh, I did. 
Security. Ooh. They lie. Who lie? Oh. Oh, keyboard. Unlock the main doors. Yes, please. Trying to sing the music. No. Okay. Restart the generator in the basement. I don't like it, don't try to fight. Please don't hurt me. <laughs> Press square to exit. Um, fuck off. I can still hear him. Bruh. Oh, Christ. Can I hide in that locker? Anybody else want to try and come and kill me? No? Oh fuck. No, I've got to get down to the basement. Are you fucking serious? I have two minutes left of this video. Not even that. Oh, good lord. What the fucking hell? He went that way. I don't want to go that way. Oh no, I'm running out of batteries on my night vision. Shit! No, that's not what I want. You're open. No, nope, fuck it. No. Nope. I'm sorry, it's a shit video, guys, but I can't do it. Oh, are you fucking for real? Case file, case file, case file. Yes! From Helen Grant to Group Markov. Project War Rider on site inspection. This. Oh shit. Dear sirs, the full report pending. No immediate action is required on the part of the Murkoff Corp. The profit potential in Project War Rider remains strangely high. The th oh, it's the light reflecting on my TV. Christ. What was I reading? Correct. Pro Project War Rider remains strangely high. The four facilities contain enough ambiguous data to make any leg legislation. Le litigation. Le leg legislation? No. I don't know. If evidence is correctly managed, impossible. Oh, right, okay. The four facilities contain ambiguous to make all data. If evidence is correctly managed, impossible. Project Rural Rider remains a dangerous initiative, and there will be, there will almost certainly be further casualties. As with the others, however, family and government interest in the patients is so slow as to make any chance of legal actions vanishingly unlikely. Violence among patients is increasing as the morphogenic engine therapy gets closer to producing working models. But a combination of physical and chemical restraints has been proven sufficiently effective to assure contain control and profit. Respectfully, Helen Grant. Run out. Are you dead? Oh, your head is facing the wrong way. Bruh. I don't know who you are. Is the time change at all? Oh, it has. Correct. I've only been in this house for four minutes. Go away. I'm about to die. Oh, hey. 
Oh, that's boring. Oh, thank God for that. I can't even remember where I came. Alright, I'll go. Wait, where the. Oh. Oh, the basement is where the wheelchair is. Oh, the witch. Oh, there's light down there. That's not me. I'm going to leave this video here. I'm going to go back to the control room so I can see. I'm going to leave this video here. Um, this is what happens when I play horror games. But I love it because it's fucking hilarious. <laughs> so... <clears throat> That was it for Outlast. I don't want to go down into the basement, but I have to. I don't want to. So anyway guys, if you like this video, wall up that like button and subscribe to stay tuned for more content from me. And I will see you in the next video. Bye! What's down there? Oh, wrong button. Little fake. <laughs> I'm dead. And who are you then? I have no idea.